Hey guys, so sorry I'm like way down here. You guys are actually on a tripod. Um, I'm gonna start this vlog off a little bit differently today. Except my baby, she's always here with me. Um, what happened to Cracker? Um, I kind of wanted to show you guys. Do you just not like when I talk to the camera? You baby, you can't have my water, my hot water. No, you have one in your hand. Look. I don't want it. That's yours. That's yours. Um, but anyways, I kind of wanted to show you guys. Oh, that was open mouth. Um, I kind of wanted to show you guys my morning routine. Not for like makeup and beauty and stuff, but my fitness morning routine. What? What? Because it's fairly new and I want to stick to it really bad. I don't know why you're running so much. I don't know why you're running so much. <laughs> um, but I just want to show you guys everything that I that I do for getting ready in the morning for fitness. And after I do this, <laughs> after I do this routine, I always feel like really good and really energized for the day. So I always start in the morning. First thing in the morning, I go down to my Keurig and I brew up some hot water. I feel like I'm so low right here. Well, I brew up some hot water and I put half a lemon into it. It's gross. It's really, really gross. <laughs> it's really gross. So I always. Oh, what? No! No! get down um so I always kind of whoa <laughs> wash it down with something so I always eat a pastry crisp after these are from special K and they literally have like nothing to do with the workout except just to kind of get the taste out of your mouth because it it's almost like salt water but just I don't know which I would prefer to drink oh my God. <laughs> what this girl's issue is today <laughs> what but we are gonna get started I'm gonna show you guys a couple workouts that I also do in the morning I try to do them at least four times a day um, side note I am NOT the one that came out with this workout um, I was watching this girl Khalil Kalo something like that and she was showing kind of her um, routine of doing every day sort of like she showed the exercises that she tries to do every day so I uh, I don't want to take no you're not getting into that I don't want to take any credit with that so let's go ahead and I gotta throw my hair up I am first gonna quickly down this lemon water it's the most sad part of the day that was absolutely disgusting. That is like the worst part of my day. So I am going to go ahead and show you some of the workouts that I keep walking because they're outside my window. Don't let your dog take a shit on my lawn. Thanks. So the first um, exercise that we're going to be doing is called a side lift. So basically you just stand up and then you kind of just squat forward. Now I don't have a lot of room so I have to turn to the side so I have room to kick. And I gotta watch out for her. But you just lift up your leg and kick out. <laughs> Did I make you nervous? But you just kind of go at it fast. Baby girl, I'm gonna end up taking you out. Ooh, I lost my balance. Um, but I try to do that four times a day, 15 reps on each leg. Um, so that is the first exercise. Now these exercises are based mostly for the booty and for the abs. I'm pretty much happy ah. everywhere else. We will be doing 15 minutes of cardio after the video, but oh. these are just the exercises that I like to do. <clears throat> so I do 30 squats in a set. So I'm going to spread my knees about shoulder length apart and we are just gonna go down and up. Hi and bye. Oh, she got his stuff. So do 30 of those. Alright, for this next one I gotta move you guys way down. These are called leg lifts. I do 15 on either leg. Hi baby girl. Hi. So you just get down on the ground. <laughs> 
your eye. You plant your hands right by your side. <laughs> Are you gonna add extra weight? Are you? Well, if you have a baby, use her. <laughs> and we're going to lift. Keep one leg bent. Lift the other. And we're gonna do 15 reps. Ready, right, baby? position here. We're going to keep one leg bent, extend the other leg, <laughs> and we're going to lift. So we do this 15 times on either leg. <laughs> is once again on the floor we are going to be planking I don't have my phone on me because it's recording at the moment so you can hold it anywhere from 30 to 30 seconds to a minute we're gonna try to go for a minute see how long we can last so planking it was a big trend not long ago so I'm gonna plant my elbows down and make a square extend your body in almost a push-up and just hold it it looks a lot harder than it is I'm sorry, it looks a lot easier than it is. All right, our next exercise is called X crunches. So I need to lean back, my love. I need to lean back. Hi, oh, ow, give me that pen. So I'm going to lean back, take my feet up and cross them. Beba, I need room. <laughs> I need room. Ow, don't throw the brush at me. Then you're going to position your arms in a normal crunching position and we're going to go up, then we're going to go to the left, then we're going to go to the right. I'm just going to do 30 of these all together. Alright, our last exercise before we do some cardio are called heel rises. So we're going to lean back on our elbows. We're gonna extend our legs and we're going to lift them like a so. Don't let them touch the ground. You can try to do 30 of these. These are really t hard to do, so do it till you feel comfortable. All right, so those are all the exercises. So now, give me that. Um, I'm gonna do 15 minutes of cardio. You can run, you can jog in place, which I'm probably gonna do. You can dance. Um, but I need my phone for this one because I need some music. So I will see you guys after 15 minutes of cardio. All right, one more thing guys. Sorry, my head's sort of cut off. For some reason, Ella got tired early and She's taking a nap. <laughs> but um, after my workout, you know, I don't want to be sore or anything. So I've been kind of practicing yoga a little bit. Yoga is very, very new to me. But there was one move that I really did enjoy. And she stood shoulder length apart. And then she, what the hell did she do? She, I think, intertwined her fingers. And then she just took in a deep breath. And then she really... She went like this, up over my head. I'm sorry, you can't really see, but I'm just stretching. I'm opening up my chest, taking a few turns just to really open everything up. Bring my hands down slowly with fingers extended. I'm sorry, over here is super white. <laughs> Bring it down. And it just really helps to open everything up and stretch out all that hard work you just did. One more time, we'll bring it down. So that is pretty much the routine that I am trying to follow every day. Look at my makeup. Guys, I am not kidding. What I just showed you for a workout like really gets you sweating. And there's been a lot of workouts I've done before that never even closely, I don't know how mascara got down here, <laughs> even came close to making me sweat the way I was with what I was just showing you. And 
Again, you don't have to do them all like one right after the other. You can do them all throughout the day so you don't sweat like that and you can still go through your day. But it's very effective for the lazy or busy person. <laughs> I, you know, I go to the gym a couple times a week and that's where I really buckle down and really concentrate on working out. But if I'm home, it's so hard because there's always a million and a half things to do, a house to maintain, a baby to raise, you know what I mean? So if you ever, I, I wanna make a chart, um, I'll probably do it today. Today with all those workouts with boxes I got this idea from her as well um, the Khalil girl um, and just X them off as you go you know don't make it your goal to fill every box every day but you know it's kind of a constant reminder hang it somewhere that you see all the time hang it on your fridge <laughs> um, and that's what I'm gonna be doing so on top of going out and working out a couple times a week at the gym I'm also going to be doing this morning routine I just feel so awake and energetic and I usually don't I'm not a morning person at all um, I have been talking to a few people about proteins I should be taking and how to eat healthier and stuff and how to eat cleaner and I have to get um, this thing called whey pro protein or we protein it's like w-h-e-y protein i don't know how to pronounce it but i want to go to gmc and get some stuff so thank you for everybody who's been helping me by the way i know there's probably a couple of you watching this but this is a fitness journey it's it's a journey <laughs> it's not a road trip oh well, it's 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 long <laughs> but again if you um, I'm not gonna like keep you guys updated on my vlogs all the time because I feel like that can get a bit repetitive um, but again I will be posting one picture a week on Saturdays on my Instagram at Shazone um, mostly of my abs because this is the area that I'm really trying to work out I'm happy with my arms um, I'm happy with my legs um, I'm just kind of working on toning up this booty <laughs> and working on my abs so Okay, so we are downstairs now. Um, I feel like Bunny today. Anybody else get the sassy bun today? That's what I feel like, which is awesome. An awesome thing to feel like. Um, <laughs> we are downstairs now. Um, I did some editing. I got some videos up and I did a little bit of organizing in my bedroom. But now we are going to hang out downstairs and she's going to get into everything over there that christmas stuff i was like tj can we please move that and then i realized that christmas is over in like four or five days so i'm like whatever <laughs> we'll live with it for four or five more days and then it's going right back down the cellar so that mess will be out of the way but anywho besides my personal problems i got this spiced apple cider mix from one of my friends um who sent it to me through my p.o box and i've never tried apple cider before so i was really interested and it's just it's a spiced apple cider i don't know if i mentioned that um but it has 80 calories you just add water to it so i've already gone ahead and uh, heated up my Keurig so I'm just gonna put a little bit of hot water into a mug and she's getting into stuff and mix in the drink oh crap I should have made it like in the mug that I got with that PO box it's actually in my strainer at the moment I was just putting away dishes and I'm like oh there's the mug I was looking for it I didn't know if I left it at my mom's or something but crap but oh well I don't want to dirty two dishes but I promise I still have it and I still love it okay so while I wait for my uh, apple cider to cool down a little bit so I can drink it um, I am making Ella some lunch but I'm gonna include a really short clip after this part oh thank you Kisses? Kisses? That's our new thing is kisses. Kisses? <laughs> um, I'm gonna insert a really short clip my mom sent me when she was babysitting Ella last night. It was really, really cute. Um, I had mentioned at the end of my vlog yesterday that my brother is not gonna make it for Christmas, so they sent him this video, but it's so damn cute. I wanna share it with you guys, so enjoy. Come here. Come say hi to Uncle Adam. Say hi, Uncle Adam. Where are you going? You don't like that flashlight? Arabella, come see Papa. Say hi. Ella. Ella, you got big lipstick marks on your face from Mimi, huh? 
<laughs> also, uh, tomorrow, well, I hope you enjoy that clip. Um, also, tomorrow, my mom said that we're gonna have dinner with my Nana and Papa, and my Nana's not doing, like, great. She's had cancer for a really long time. Like, it was in, um, what's the term, remission? She had it, and, you know, it was in remission, and then it came back, and... It's been a long going battle, but I really want to see her, and I don't want to say it like this, but I don't know how much longer I'm going to have with her, and I love her, love her, love her, so <laughs> I take advantage of any time that I have with her. You dropped it, Baboos! Um, any any advantage, any <laughs> opportunity that I get to see her, I see her, so that'll be fun. We'll get to get ready and go have some dinner, but this isn't until tomorrow, so. Oh my goodness, so Ella was playing with this over here and she found two ornaments that I forgot about. So we have this one, was, which was baby's first Christmas, which was supposed to go on my tree last year. Clearly it didn't. Uh, but she also found this one, which was on my tree last year. And it says, Shayna, TJ, I'm sorry, I'm just showing you. It says, Shayna, TJ, Ella. And it has little owls on it so i'm gonna pop those on my tree because of my whole like health kick right now this used to be empty but it's so funny because i'll sometimes have bananas because ella likes them um recently though she hasn't been wanting them i don't know why but i have a bunch of oh there's a <laughs> oh no I'm squishing the bananas oh they're i think they're pretty uh ripe at this point anyway so i'm actually gonna go ahead and take those out i didn't even realize those were at the bottom of the lemons. Those are funny. I'll have to buy some more. Um, but I only love apples. I love Granny Smith apples. And I love oranges. And the lemons are for the lemon water. That is absolute hell every morning. So my husband and I... I have so much to show you guys today. <laughs> my husband and I bought this prank box um, before the Christmas Eve party we had yesterday because we were trying to get someone specific for this, but we weren't able to. But I figured we could keep it because we have a lot of friends with babies. But it, it's so funny. So look at this. It's almost like a hamster feeder. <laughs> and it's called the Crib Dribbler. Perfect for Kindex Infant Energy Drink. Water and juice in cocoa and formula in milk my daughter has my dish soap I don't think so um, part of a healthy upbringing um, like every side is so funny look at two indicator stickers a rag dragon means it's warm like literally someone might look at this and genuinely think it's a real thing look they have energy drinks like a fake coupon I want you to get out of that cabinet on the back is even funnier um, these are like the energy drinks, the weekender. <laughs> Go to dinner and a movie, plus stay at a cute bed and breakfast that you've been dreaming of. The weekender has you covered with its enormous 100 ounce capacity. Uh, and the overnighter, put your feet up and relax. Kindex original crib dribbler model holds 40 ounces and mounts to any crib. Um, and oh my god, I died. I forgot I had a baby for six wonderful hours. My husband and I enjoyed a romantic dinner on a Tuesday. She's from Iowa. <laughs> I really like that it's made from recycled plastic syringes. <laughs> it makes me feel like I'm helping the world from New York. It's so funny. Uh, every baby wants... Look at the picture. <laughs> uh, every baby wants to be left alone. They're young, developing minds while constantly processing skills like balance, vision, coordination, and speech are better served in quiet, solitary environment. With the Kindex Crib Dribbler, baby will have a, the alone time she needs while you enjoy some quiet time to yourself so we actually found this at walmart it was only a couple bucks so if you so funny oh my goodness look this <laughs> snack tray oh my god it's so funny um again we got this at walmart for a couple bucks so if you have a friend or a family member that has a sense of humor and would get really get a kick out of this i would pick it up oh my goodness i have this one too i didn't even realize it but yeah we got married in 2014 we're not going to do the advent calendar tonight because we're actually a day ahead by mistake, but we still have to rip off the chain. Don't slap my ass. Ella! Have it. Wait, she, I don't think she can... Get it! Get it, boo-boo! 